Praise the Lord. Lift up Jesus. He is King of Kings. He Lord Jesus. He is Lord of Lords. Lift up Jesus. He is King of Kings. King of Kings and Lord of Lords. Lift up Jesus. He is King of Kings. Lift up Jesus. He is Lord of Lords. Lift up Jesus. He is King of Kings. King of Kings and Lord of Lords. Father, we thank you because you are good. You are a father indeed. We thank you for keeping all of us alive to see today this day that has no equality. Father, we thank you. We thank you on behalf of the land of Rumodo that you have made it possible for us to experience what is happening today. We thank you on behalf of uh, our amiable governor, Nyeso Ezenwa Wike, who has made it possible that this light should shine in the land of Rumodo. Father, we pray, as he has made, set this light, that no darkness can comprehend. Father, you take him higher to, the, to ask for rock. Let his uh, governance never end here. Father, we are calling on you. You are a gracious father. You have made room Rumodogo that has been in darkness to come to light. May all that experience this uh, occasion come to enjoy the light in Jesus' name. Father, we are asking you that this road that will be commissioned today, we hand it over to you. Let evil men not operate along the road. Let it continue to be a peaceful road so that whosoever passes this road will enjoy life indeed. Father, we are aiming that this road should take us to connect us with collaborative people. Let it happen in our lives in Jesus' name. Father, we commit everything that is going to happen here over to you. May you take over and ensure that our amiable governor does whatever he wants to do peacefully and safely, and all of us will enjoy the benefit of his coming here today. In the name of God the Father, Amen. God the Son, Amen. and God the Holy Spirit. Amen. Your Excellency, Yesu is the one we K, C O N, G S S R S, Life Bencher, Governor of River State. Your Excellency, Dr. Mrs. Palibohari Banigo, D S S R S, Deputy Governor of River State. Ambassador Desmond Akawa, Chairman, People's Democratic Party, River State. Distinguished Senators, particularly Senator Barinadam Piggy, Right Honorable Prince Chibudom Wuche, OFR, former Deputy Speaker, House of Representatives, members of the National and State Assembly here present, members of the State Executive Council, Your Majesty, King Dr. Danderson Douglas Jaja, CFR, JP, JK V, Treaty King, and Amina Bobo Pobo. Chairman, River State Council of Traditional Rulers, and all the Royal Majesties and Royal Highnesses here present, Elder Statesmen, Special Advisors, Chairman of Local Government Councils here present, Permanent Secretaries, Ladies and Gentlemen, welcome to the commissioning of Rumo Dogo 1 and 2 Link Road, constructed by the Government of River State. Your Excellencies, Distinguished Ladies and Gentlemen, May I at this point respectfully invite for the presentation of Colonel Eze C. N. Didia Yenweli Emeda on behalf of Emoha Local Government Area Traditional Rulers Council, supported by Oha Michael Uchebel Bule Yenweli Rumodogo and his council.
Meka. 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 Ta ba ji. Ele e mo ho aloka government. Nderu modugo. Ngwe ni ni ho magi me na e. Ime le kla. Ime le kla ka gi me. Nya ho makla. Do kla ya ma meka. Chineke gozi. Ha gi me a. Chineke do kwa si ogwa. Nda garu ha ta. Ma go. Churu kre a. Churu nda ha. Meka. Chineke gozi ne wa Jesus. Ha we janye. Anta ya. Nae huwa ma ne u buwa ma. Onwe he do me. Oku gitiri da. Ido jala. Chineke gozi ne wa Jesus. Amen. My governor, we know why they remove me. One and two. I can't allow me. Nobody leave me without they remove me. I hung up a rope from our forefathers. Do that go. Any no good night. Oh, you chill it. Any chill it, girl. I just don't bother. What's so well done on the nobody one? Anu wa vime ludo. Imele. Lumodo koka meka ni. Nukia jifume meko lumpake. Nse no fe. Lumpake. Ele no go broke no go mini baba. Magwa wo mini no ru. Mini no ru le yana wo. Wanda chime kwa upwe. Aroto. Imele ma. Azile tru. Ni ina. Kwa meka ni. Nusi te tan. Nous voulons nous mettre au goût. Mais les mis à ces événements. Quand vous mettez les événements, vous allez nous avoir. Nous allons nous mettre au goût. 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 Car nous allons nous mettre au goût. Et voilà, il y a un autre mot. Et c'est un autre mot. Il y a 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 un autre mot. Ya hame, generation to generation, that's why I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I think I'm going to do this January 2020. So, yeah. No, you know, car is I, uh, His Excellency, room of the people have decided to give some plots of land to you. At the appropriate time, you send a survey to come and. Uh, survey the land to know the extent of the land room the people have given to you. As a token of appreciation to what you have done to us, it's too wonderful to us. Just as Psalm 126 say that when Lord turned away the captivity of Zion, it's like them that are dreams. We are glad we are singing, room the people are singing over what you have done to us. It has seen the the period where we women wear pines to cross 
about one kilometer of water. Who every road of a woman has trouser. Every road of a woman has pipe. So you have wiped away this hardship from us. Only God will pay you. Because of that, we are very, very glad and we are saying it. Thank you. Your Excellency, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, to give the welcome remarks, may I invite the Chairman of the Mohawk Government Area, Dr. Chidi Lloyd. POS Africa, Diko Haikwere, Ezi Herumo Dogo, and Governor of River State. Your Excellency, the Deputy Governor, Dr. Mrs. Paliboha Rebanigo, Distinguished Service Star of River State. Your Excellency, please permit me to adopt the protocols as brilliantly and eloquently established by the Compare. Your Excellency, today we are in Rumodogo, and I want to adopt this, the prayer of Bishop Rewa as if they were mine. But in doing so, sir, I would quickly add that on the 1st of October 2020, a few months after I made a detour back to the People's Democratic Party, I came with somebody. Chief Azunda and Governor. Your Excellency, when I came back to you, I told you I was going to be a fisher of men for you. And on the 3rd of October, I came with Chief Azunda and Governor and Chief Chigunoye Akujuro. In course of our discussion, Chief Azunda and Governor pleaded with you to construct the Rumodogo 1 and 2 road. He had barely finished his statement when you immediately agreed that you were going to construct this road. And on the, your Excellency, you didn't stop there. On the 3rd of October, you paid a visit to this community and promised them, albeit that we stopped at Rumo Dogo 1, where you promised them that you were going to construct this road. Your Excellency, I bet that you have never been here before until very recently when you came on inspection. And when you agreed to construct this road, a few weeks later, you presented your budget to the River State House of Assembly. And the Rumodogo Road was captured in that budget. And not only was it captured, when the River State House of Assembly graciously passed the 2021 appropriation law, you, you, the contractor immediately mobilized to sites. Your Excellency, I want to say today that you have given a new style of leadership to Nigeria. You are the precursor of modern budgeting. You do not believe in cost plan analysis as we used to do when we were members of the River State House of Assembly. You want to construct a road, you make provisions for four years. Your Excellency, for you, if you want to construct a road, you fund the road and you complete the road. So when we help people who do not have anything to offer to their people, plead terrain as the reason why they will not develop their place. Your Excellency, if they are looking for terrain, I would have said they should come to Rumodogo. It was easier for Rumodogo people to assess Haristan, which is just about three kilometers to the waterfront. Haristan is to Rumodogo people what Portacot is to those from Rumuchi. And Your Excellency, I want to inform all of us today that this town that is otherwise known as Olua is the birthplace of Cardinal Jim Lawson. This is the birthplace of the late Honorable Jim Brother Ewan George. 
This is the birthplace of Reverend C.T.T. George. This is the birthplace of Professor, Professor Tafford George and a host of other Calabari sons and daughters. So, Your Excellency, I would not explain what you have done here today. And we wouldn't have chosen any other better venue for this commissioning other than this place. And I am sure all those that are in your interact have seen what you have done here today. It was difficult to assess this community even in dry season. So, Your Excellency, for us in the name of our local government, this is the third on the, on, on, in the series of commissioning of projects. How else would we thank you? Other than to say to you that we pray, our prayers are with you. We pray that God should continue to keep you for us. God should continue to keep your family. And like we have always prayed, that God should contend with those who contend with you and fight those who fight you, Your Excellency. We owe you just one thing in the moment. We owe you just one thing, and that is our votes. Not one will drop. We will give our votes. 100% for the People's Democratic Party. And Your Excellency, we are also at home with the leadership of the party in the local government. We are at home with the leadership of as a principal, Woke one or day. We are at home with the leadership of Unewe Lemowa, Nere, or her sergeant, Chidi Awuse, who is unavoidably absent today. And of course, we are at home with the leadership of the Chief of Staff Government House. Together, Your Excellency, we will continue to drag the dividends of good governance to aim our local government. And for me in particular, I cannot thank you enough that all these developments are happening under my watch as chairman of aim our local government. Here, once again, Your Excellency, let me welcome you and your entourage to Olua, Rumo Dogo, aim our local government area. Thank you and God bless you.
ไปนั่งงงอาวุธบังงาตาดูมินาเซเรวิตาตัวดูพุชิเกเรซันโอเววิตาตีกุ้งเว้ยเว้ยนี่เซเว้ยเซเว้ยวิตาบังงาดูโกกุ้งเว้ยไอ้เอ็มว่าอาจจะว่าเราอีกว่าเลยกูก็ไปเลยกว่าหนูไม่สูเลยกว่าเว้ยYour Excellencies, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, please can we put our hands together for them as they dance out? Thank you very much. May I now invite to entertain us the Owembe Masquerade Dance. Thank you very much, Hilaria Rumodogo. Your Excellencies, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, may I at this point invite to entertain us the Owembe Masquerade Dance.
Your Excellences, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, please can we put our hands together for Wembe Masquerade Dance. Excellences, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, please can we put our hands together one more time for Wembe Mastery Dance. Thank you very much, Wembe Mastery Dance. Thank you. Thank you. Your Excellences, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, may I now invite to entertain us Obuduotha Wrestling Group.
Excellences, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, please can we put our hands together one more time for Goodwater Wrestling Group. Thank you very much. Thank you. Your Excellences, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, at this point may I invite for the project description the Honorable Commissioner for Special Projects, River State, Honorable Dema Iyala. and the waterfront is 3.86 kilometers. By the time you get to the waterfront, you'll just be seeing Harris Town. That is what this road is. The width of the road is 7.3 meters. It was filled with sharp sand and soft base with a depth of 0.8 meters. Stone base of 150 mm as base material. A drainage length of 13.86 km, offshoot, a bracket discharge drain of 100 meters to convey the off runoff. This gives a total drainage length of 13.96 km. This road has 17 culverts constructed across the road. The road has two layers of asphalt. One is binder course of 16 mm thickness, a wearing course of 40 mm thickness. This road was an earth road before it was constructed. The road connects two major communities in Emoa, Rumo Dugo 1 and Rumo Dugo 2 to the east-west road. Your Excellency, this road will enhance development and commercial activities within and around the communities in the local government area. Also open it up to several hectares of land, which can be used for agricultural purposes and property development. It will ease commercial activities in terms of transportation of farm produce through the east-west road. Your Excellency, you have written your name in gold as far as the people of Rumodugo 1 and Rumodugo 2 are concerned. Thank you, Your Excellency. Your Excellencies, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, to give a remark on behalf of the contractor, Ferrotex Construction Company Limited. May I invite Jack Afara? C O N G S S R S Life Venture. Your Excellency, the Deputy Governor of River State, Dr. Mrs. Ipalibo Harry Banigo. DSSRS, all of the protocols observed. Your Excellency, with deepest appreciation, 
We accept this honor to speak on behalf of our company, Ferrotex Construction Company, and with great sense of honor and pride, welcome all present to Emoha Local Government Area of River State for the commissioning of Rumo Dogo 1 and to Link Roads, which is in alignment with Your Excellency's fulfillment of the Rural Transformation Agenda and River State. Your Excellency, Fairtex Construction Company is one of the few indigenous companies that was given the opportunity and privilege to serve you and the great people of River State. And that has successfully accomplished this project that's about being commissioned today to the glory of God. Your Excellency, I would like to give first thanks to our Creator God Almighty. Your Excellency, I would also like to give thanks to you for considering us worthy of being a part and also one of your overachieving teams in realizing your vision in the era of rural development in the state. I would, I, all, I would also like to say with great privilege and humility that we are one of the lucky ones that were given the opportunity to showcase our capabilities and competence which you have honored us with. For that we are eternally grateful and we will continue to make you and the great people of River State proud, sir. We would also like to give many thanks to our host community for being cooperative and helpful in every possible way and mostly accommodating. For without the peace we had with our host community, we wouldn't have realized the compl completion of the project successfully and in the time and manner in which we did. We would also thank the Honorable Commissioner for Special Projects, Sir Dima Iyala, and his entire team, who kept us well guided and ensured that all specifications were adhered to at every given time throughout the project cycle. Also a big thanks to the local government chairman, Chief Chidi Lloyd, for being our side, using whatever resources at his disposal to ensure that we faced absolutely no issue on the project. I would also like to recognize and appreciate our chairman, Mr. Festers Oshaba, Sir, your tenacity and aggressiveness towards our projects are what has kept us growing on from strength to strength. And your ideology of not accepting anything less than perfect on all our jobs, no matter who our client may be, has been the source of success story. And finally, our able working committed management team and staff that is the driving force behind this project and its realization. I say thank you to all. Thank you, Your Excellency. Thank you, the people of Rumo Dogo, and thank you, the people of River State. God bless you all. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, at this point, may I respectfully invite to give his address and thereafter commission the Rumo Dogo 1 and 2 Link Road, the Governor of River State, His Excellency Nyesu Ezenwawike, Commander of the Order of the Niger, Grand Service Star of River State, Life Venture. Yes, Professional profession, infrastructure professor. Now you they do they do do do. Iyelele, iyo iyelele, iyo iyo. Melamba melamba. I did it there, I did it there. I see the pen you they sweet me. Rekete pe pe pe. Yes, a week. La 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 la. Your Excellency, the Deputy Governor of Lima State, 
the distinguished senator representing River Southeast, Senator Barnada Mpigi, the former deputy speaker of the House of Representatives, Right Honorable Chibudom Muche, the Esema of Ekbe Land, former Deputy National Chairman of our party, the Chairman of our party, Ambassador Desmond Akawo, the incoming Deputy Governor representing our boss, the incoming Governor, Professor Ngozi Maodo, Distinguished senators that are here, members of the State Executive Council, traditional rulers that are here, particularly those of MOHA, local government, and in particular the Rumodogo communities. Leaders of our local government, our very beautiful women who have come out here in their numbers to give us very, very interesting songs. Our dear youth that are here, gentlemen of the press, ladies and gentlemen. I call us about Mecca. I call us about Mecca. I'm going to talk about Mecca. I'm going to talk about Mecca. I'm going to talk about My dear brothers and sisters, today is the 1st of December, 2022. We give God the glory that we are able to see the month of December and we will see next year by the grace of God. Today is a special day of all the commissioners who have had, I've not been touched the way I'm touched in today's commissioning. Some of you may not understand what we are talking about because you may have been lucky to come from where there are roads to come from where government has provided amenities for you. This is, a, this is a community or communities, as the case may be, that have never seen the presence of government in terms of road. This is an agricultural community. They are not just farmers. Yet, whatever they produce cannot come to the market because there's no, there's no road. And I've told anybody who cares, nobody knows whom God will send tomorrow to bail you out. When she, the Lord came with a young man, is it in command or what? We don't know. I think so. Asunda. He came, they came. I said they want to join us. That they have left the wilderness. But the only thing they asked from me 
They said, look, if you can help us to give us road, they did not ask for money. They asked for what? Road. He came, they came. Yes, so we can help us so hide your face. I instantly promised them go home and sleep. By the special grace of God, we will do this road. Yes, a week When I came to flag off this road, I never entered here. It was commissioned at the junction of the East West Road. Until some time when I came for inspection, I wept. I never told the community that was coming. I told the council chairman, let us drive down to Rumudugo. Let me see about the job we gave out. It was when I came here and I said, God, I thank you for using me as a vessel to provide this infrastructure. I got to the waterfront that the boundary between them and Degema. Today we are here, first of December, to commission this road. I was watching on television this morning. I overheard one of the ministers. I don't know which of the ministry, if I forget, because I don't normally like to remember where they come, I don't know. With the service, the Minister of State for Budget or this and that, I don't know. You know, when they go on television, they open their mouth and talk anyhow. He said, Oh, governors are a problem. They don't do rural roads. And I asked him, Where and where have you been? You just sit down there. You have not been to anywhere to go and check whether there have been rural roads that have been done or not. And you open your book of cavity <laughs> because you have the opportunity as a minister to talk anyhow. Come to River State and see whether we are doing roads that will lead to the agricultural produce to be brought out or not before you open your mouth. We are not only we are not doing roads in the city alone. We are doing roads in all local government areas of this state. So I'm proud. What is governance all about? Governance is all about happiness of the people. Rumor to people, are you happy? Rumor to the people, are you happy? Follow Udo Rodo 2023. Follow Udo Rodo. So, Mr. Minister, who is always in Abuja because of the appointment they gave you, come and ask some Dogo people the impact of this road as agri community. What will happen? So, so, as far as you are happy, I'm happy. Yes. Isn't that true? Yes. When you are happy, I'm uh, happy. When you are angry, I'm uh, angry. As he depend them, he dey see with us. As he dey see with us, he go dey sip 
of other parties. So we have to watch them. Anybody who not a mother go, a mother are you a Anybody who not a mother go, a mother are you a wire? I will promise. Tabu promise made. Promise fulfilled. I don't know. My dear, tomorrow. Ah, uh as -uh. many kids are tomorrow. Keep your idea half. I don't know. Keep your idea half. So, 2023 election. And you are going to vote. You should be governor KBS. Bad governors will be PDP. Right where I was in line, full bar of liar. Oblaya, Oblaya, Ani Eguaru vote. You should know all the world on Yesu. Yankees on the scene net. Nabuja no Mary present. Ali Honoha, Eche, Nundeo Krika. Oblaya, Oblaya, Oblaya. No have an assembly pa. Ani Eguaru vote. Yega wa sister. They gave me that support from time to time. But it just in a mercy. Oblaya! 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 Aha! Kabo! 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 Oblaya! The president, my aha! Oblaya! Oblaya! Hello, Wudo Rodo. We can say, follow Wudo Rodo. Sing for Barra. This man should not sing again for the Libya. Now, 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 only. As a part. You heard that's ready. I'm poor. I'm here. 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 I'm so everybody, Melamba, Melamba, and the Macaran, Ozio Togu, Ozio Togu, one Gangapa, is very, very, very capable. Mama, I'm going to go to work. I'm going to go to work. the capacity. I'm going to go to work. 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 I'm going to
Hold on, I'm watching my Yagaba. So, I see him on my line, Mini. Now I can say, Kai, make him autumn has come. Has come. I see him on the way. Bubu Baba Bunde Bogi Bogi. I'm going to make it again. So, I know where you are from, my pa. Can I know where you are from? Can I know where you are from? Baba, I know where you are from. I'm going to go to the road. 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 My brother, can I go to the road? So, I'm going to go to the road. Mbrea ni zipa o kini ke mere siri pa la rumu dogo. Nyari ba rumu dogo, nyari ba dogo ri yare pa ya. Abla ya. So mo kusuli kiam, but ma dehe kore do. Anu kama ya? Ma ya ha ya ah boys ah man aje ba abla ya. Chege po kwa abla kum. Now, my brothers and sisters, you know why we are commissioning the project? You know why? Heat is too much, I beg. I should ask you. If you can touch you, yes, so we can touch you. Yes, so we can touch you. Hunger, go, go. Now, now, yes, so we can touch you. Yes, so we can touch you. Hunger, go. Now listen. Now listen. One of the reasons why we are commissioning some of our projects. You remember? You remember in May 27, 2015, our brother, who was the governor of River State, on his birthday, when he was leaving office, that your brother who refused to do this Motogo Road. Oblaya! Oblaya! He told us that there's no way we will get money to pay salary. There is no way. Who we'll get money to pay pensioners and their gratuities? Not to talk about doing projects. That was what our brother said in May 27, 2015. I took over in May 29, 2015. Two days after his birthday. And then we say, God, you must show that you are God. If a man has decreed so, God, why are you God? You must show that you are God. And so, God is infinite mercy. God is infinite mercy. Did not only anybody else so. I want to double give you a gift. I want to give you So, God is infinite mercy because of the love He has for the people of this state. God did not only provide money for us to pay salaries, God did not only provide money to pay pensioners and their gratuities, God has provided money 
Today, we have done remote of the road. Today, a governor then that had all the money, God gave him all the money. He refused to do this road. And he said, we will not get money. He thinks that people of Rumatoko will still be backward. God said, no. The time has come for Rumatoko to be remembered. The time has come that people must know a community for Rumatoko. And today is your day. And you have to tell them. You will pay them back with your PVC card. You will pay them back for the sofa they gave to you. So, why should I not be happy? A man said, you can't be this. A man took the position of God. As far as he was concerned, you cannot be anything. But the Almighty God said, no, who are you? I'm the one who will decide. And God decided. And today, we have money to do something. And based on that, but God used somebody to bring that money. Is it not true? Has anybody seen God one day? Even me now, God is using me to bring out more to God. So, when you thank God, would you not thank me? Would you not say, God, I give you the glory? God, I thank you for bringing a vessel. Yes. Isn't that true? Yes. If you do that, do you do bad? No. Do you do bad? No. So, what is my crime today in the Niger Delta State? What did I do? What I said, God, I thank you for using Muhammad Buhari to give me money to do this road I'm doing. Did I commit any offense? No. Did I commit any offense? No. If you go to a church and say, God, thank you, did you do bad? No. And when you thank God, say, God, thank you for using you some wicked to do the motor road, did you do bad? No. I don't know the offense I committed that I said, thank you for being a vessel, that God using you as a vessel to release money that nobody has released to us and are using the money to work for my people, it becomes a problem. But let me tell those who are making noise, whether you're a governor, I don't care. Whether whoever you are, wherever you may be, I don't care. I came to run as governor of River State. There was no governor that said, I want to put you as a governor. I came home on my own. God said, I want to use you. There was a sitting governor. We defeated the sitting governor. Some governors were brought by their godfathers. I never had any godfather to bring me as a governor. The only godfather I had was God and the people of River State. So when some governors are talking, they should know those they are talking with. We are not at the same level. We are not at the same level. And we can't be at the same level. Some people couldn't withstand the federal might. They lost in their state. Federal might came here with the army, with whatever. Did we not win? Did you not win? Does it not tell them something? Let these small, small people keep quiet. Tell them to keep uh, quiet. If you are not prepared for governance, give up. I am prepared for governance. I was prepared. I'm still prepared. I will be prepared till I leave. How can people talk? Simply I said, thank Buhari for giving us money. I'm not a fan of Buhari. 
All of you know that. I'm not one of those they like. I'm not one of those who go to Abuja to see them. But the truth must be told, when somebody has done well in an aspect, he says he has done well in this uh, aspect. I mean, you cannot change it. Whether you like me or not, I did the motor go road, is it not? It's not true. So no matter how you hate me, won't you give me that credit that I did the motor go road? So even if you don't like Buhari, should I not say he released the money that I'm using to do something? Is anything wrong in that? No. Did I commit an offense? No. Did I commit any murder case? No. So, you know, some people are not grateful in life. Even when you help them, they can never be grateful. I will continue to be grateful to people and I'll continue to be grateful to God Almighty. It doesn't matter my views about you. It doesn't matter how I may criticize you. But when you have done one good thing, I will tell you, you have done one good thing. When you have done what is wrong, I will tell you, you have done uh, wrong. Why can some people open their mouth, say, oh, three kilometer road in their state is more than how many flyovers in rivers? What an insult is that? River state is a Niger Delta state, is it not? Is it not? God bless us, we have riverine areas, we have land uh, areas. I don't know who can claim to be more riverine than River State. Before, all of us said we were desert. Now, because I said, we had a thank you. Some of them now say, oh, after all, I spent this money. I didn't tell you to give account. I never said so. All I said, thank you, Buhari. And what I expected them to do is to say, yes, thank uh, Buhari. Now you are saying you received this. Is it, what is my business? What is my business? If you say you have more water, do the one that you have water. Let us see. I have never done any project more than a year and a half. I challenge anybody. 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 I can tell you the contractors doing job in this state. I challenge them. Name them. Name those who are doing in your state. It's not whether I like you, which I don't like you. It's immaterial. Do you need to like me? Am I a girlfriend? Am I a wife? What's my business? Do your own. Not to do project four years, one project. I will never do any project in four years. I won't do it. Because doing project of four years means you are doing variation and the rest of it. I am not a party to that. Some people have been sending their people to insult me. I laugh. I hear some people, they call them acquired professionals. They were insulting me. I said, tell the man who sent you to come out. You are just small kids. I'm waiting for the big man to come. Uh, some people say, oh, it's your professional. You that are sending them come out. It's you I'm looking for. I'm not looking for all these, uh, all these fries. I don't need to do that. Back belly that we are doing 12 flyovers. Now, Mr. Make you no do. I'm not doing only roads. Go and see what we have done in health sector. Go and see. Look, I, River State Government, we, River State Government, go and see what we did in Yenegua Law School. We put not less than five point something billion to recover that school. I challenge anybody to recover the school in the South South when the Council of Legal Education gave us the campus of law school. We built it within 10 months. On record, I challenge any state commission projects in three weeks. Every day, I challenge anyone. So, what are you talking about? I'm not on the election. 
I don't need to be a sacrophant, but the truth must be told at all the time. So if you want to face wicked, come out and face wicked. Don't begin to hide. Come and face me. You know I have the capacity. There's none of them. I can. And I've told them, be careful. Be 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 how many times did I say it? All these one people are saying, we got this, we got this. Is that the first trench or second trench or the third trench? We will talk at the appropriate uh, time. I have never gone to a meeting with anybody in life and we agree on something and I abandon it. I'm not a betrayer. It's not in my blood. I will not do it. My Bible says you don't learn left hand at old uh, age. What is not in you is not uh, in you. So if you know them, go and tell them more. They should face their problems. Let me do what rivers will say I should uh, do. And rivers people are happy. I will not happy. I will not happy. I am going eight. We started since November 14. We will end tomorrow, Friday. Then by Monday, we will start flagging on new projects. New projects. New projects. New projects. I will prepare them. Do you know what I mean? Look, the politics today is not to talk. The politics now is operation. Show your report uh, card. Isn't that true? Show me what you have done, not what I will do. And that's why nobody can match us here. All those who say they are running the election, which election are they running? You want to be governor? With which party? I, I don't understand which party. Because you hear, you hear people must run for governor, therefore you go and take any party to run for governor. See this party, I don't know what they call them. The one that their brother was the governor before, I don't know. They stole everything. You saw the plane I brought back. You saw the plane? Or I see the plane. Somebody go hide them. A car of a gas turbine is self finished with a business partner. Now they want to be governor. Will you allow it? No. Will you allow it? No. I'm not hearing you. Will you allow it? No. Will you allow it? No. Let them come to Rumotogo. I can pray here. Fa, fa, fa. No. Fa, fa, fa. No. fa, fa, fa. No. Now, for the land you want to give me, I thank you. But bring the land for us to build something for the communities. I, I don't need, I, I, I have I donate the land back to you. Then I will come and build something for you. So you sit on your own and tell me what you want me to use that land to build for the people of uh, Rumbo Do you understand me? So on that basis, let me invite our leaders to join us and rejoice. If not because of the program we have, I would have stayed in Rumodogo today and generate with our people and dance with our people and wrestle with the people of Rumodogo. I can give, I can confess to you within the Queer Ethnic Nationality, one of the com uh, communities that can wrestle well. Even though they like to dress up like the Calabari people, and you go around and go around, but you know, every time you see my program, there's a problem. No more people who can wrestle, but when they see my program, there's a problem. So let me invite all of you to join us and commission this road to the glory of God. Thank you, and God bless you. Chu, chu, chu. Just 
for the glory of God. Today, the first of December, we commissioned this all important road, Ruba Dogo 1 and Ruba Dogo 2 communities, for the use of our people who are basically agrarian communities. And for the use of my time, in the name of God the Father, the name of God the Son, and God and the Holy Spirit. Rumbo Dogo 1, Rumbo Dogo 2, Lake Road and Drains, Emboa, local government area, River State, built and commissioned by our administration under my leadership on this day, Thursday 1st, December 2022, to the glory of Almighty God. The National Anthem. Jehovah Shammah, what can you make me ready?